Ha! TBH, you can't even see me. What's up, guys? It's time for another episode of Hot Tips for Your Tips. This episode is gonna be called Don't Just Wing It, Tracer Fing It. Now, what's a tracer finger? What the heck am I talking about, bro? I'll show you right now. Let's say I played this chord. Let's say right after it, I wanna go to this note. Now, a tracer finger is gonna allow me to get to that higher note with a lot more accuracy and precision than if I hadn't used it. While I'm holding down this chord, I'm actually gonna take my pinky finger and I'm gonna place it on the second string right above your D note, okay? So that's gonna be like right on the third fret. When I shift up to grab this note, I don't have to worry about finding the new note vertically. I only have to worry about finding it horizontally. Because what I can do is I can place this finger on that string, glide it all around, I don't lose contact, and it's very easy to find any note along the string. You only have to worry about the horizontal movement. So in practice, it's gonna look something like this. Play this chord. Lay the pinky on the string, don't push it down all the way. Slide the finger up, then apply all the pressure I need to make that note clean AF. This is like one little simple example, but there's not a single song that I play that doesn't use an extensive amount of this, okay? This is a really important thing to get used to. Check this example out. So one of the strings that one of our fingers is on when we play the first chord is actually going to be on the second chord as well. So that one's easy. And I'm talking about the middle finger here, bro. The middle finger here is going to stay on that string and slide all the way up to the sixth fret. Take your index finger and actually place it on the first fret of the second string behind what the third finger is already holding down. All you have to worry about is finding the frets. You don't have to worry about finding the strings because you did that work beforehand when you had more time to do it. And then all I do is I lift up the third finger while I'm doing my shift and it allows me to land here with ease. With ease. Get it? Ease. Like the note E. <laughs> So bro, next time you gotta do a gnarly slide on your guitar and you got a finger open and what you and you can you can do a tracer finger, hey go ahead and do it man. Go ahead and just use that tracer finger, bro, because it's gonna make your life a lot easier, bro. <laughs> okay, peace dog.